welcome back to the car shocker. My name is Jimmy Prater. I'm a car closer. That's what I am. I close the goals. I close. I close car deals. I close them and gross them. And you do the same thing. You close them and gross them. And you love that salesperson who does that, right? Only problem is the grosses are down. Why are the grosses down? The grosses are down. They got to get increased. You got to increase. You got to stop giving cars away. They're not free. Tell them to go to another dealer. If that salesperson is working for a commission, and the salesperson better be on commission, if the salesperson is working for a commission, they got to have gross. Boy, that's what the car shocker is all about is gross. You're going to see a happy floor. You're going to be a new happy motors. Just put happy motors out there. Everybody's happy. Everybody's happy if they're making money, right? But if they're not making money, they're not happy. Do you want them to be happy or not? Happy salespeople. Happy, happy, happy. Listen, the car shocker likes happiness. That's what we do. We like to be happy. We like to have fun. We like to be happy. But the only way that's going to happen to be happy is if they're motivated to do their job. And that job is to make money. That's all their job is. Their job, their job isn't selling a car. Their job is there to gross. They just want to make money. They're closers. Yes, they are closers. Salespeople are closers. See, you got two closers in a sale. You got to close the product and then you close the figures. You close the product, you close the figures. You also have to have a closer in there to close the figures. Now, who's doing that in your store? That's what the car sucker is all about. We want to help you gross and close. If you're not closing, you're not grossing, right? You got to do them both. Now, how are you going to do it? By having motivation, by being fun. Fun is exciting. Fun makes happiness. You got to have happiness inside your store. Oh, hey, don't, don't, you, don't, don't, don't you dare walk away from this video. Okay, because I haven't begun yet. I want to tell you something. The salespeople need to make more money. Now, do I have to get stern with you? Dealers, what are you doing? They got to make more money. If they're not making money, they're not going to be happy. You ever seen an angry salesman? Yeah, that's what angry salespeople do. They just talk, they go around like this and everything's a problem and everything's an issue and, and you know what, the world's coming down the end. Or they can be like this, say, hey, I'm happy. I'm making money. Wow. Woo, I'm making lots of money. See, when you say the word money, see, it makes you say, it makes you smile and say happy, right? Money, happy, angry. I don't like you. You're not allowing me to make my money. You stole my front end gross and put it on the back end. You didn't allow me to steal my trade. You gotta be happy. Hey, hey seriously. When, when are you gonna get happy in there? You gotta get you gotta get the car shocker in there. Once you get the car shocker in there, things change. We're going to take a look at the pay plans, right? That's one of the first things we're going to look at. How is the pay plan structured? Are the managers making money? See, if the managers aren't making money, that's a problem too. They got to be happy too. They got to be smiling all the time. They can't be angry. No. Can't be angry. They have to close and close and close and close them and gross them. Close them and gross them. Boy, I tell you what. The car shortage got some amazing... Amazing ways of how we structure closes on, on, on a car deal. You know, how you structure clothes. Hey, what's the first thing you do when you go in on a car deal when, you, when you're trying to close the figures anyways? What's the first thing you should know? You should know all the intel on the customer. You should know everything about the customer, everything about the deal. You just don't walk in blind. I mean, I have the, in the past. I've done that. But I make more gross when I know more about the car deal. See, everything should be a structure. It's a rules of engagement. What's the first thing you do when you, when you meet and greet a customer? What's the first thing that should come out of your mouth? A compliment. A compliment. And dealer, if you're walking through the showroom floor, you get there in that morning, you walk through the showroom floor, what are you doing? Well, you got to first meet and greet them again. Every day's a, a meet and greet. Every day's a meet and greet. Meet and greet comes with customer service, and you got to be a customer server dealer to your salespeople. You should compliment them. Figure, figure something to compliment about. Get to know them. What do they do when they're outside of work? Tell them you saw something crazy what they did the other night on Facebook. They like that. Get them happy again. That's what you got to do. You got to get them happy. Happy, happy, happy. 
Listen, if you if you like this video, you you found any interesting tips, or um, if you even just want to just subscribe, go ahead. Right there, little sharky icon down there. See that little sharky icon? Go ahead, click it, and then you got a little bell that's going to pop up, and then you can hit that, and then that's where you're going to be notified. But the, but again, if you like anything on this video, go ahead, share it, and like it. Com comment on it. Let's talk. I like friends. I like happy friends. Hey, do yourself a favor. My name is Jimmy Prater. Go close something. Yeah.